Hello everyone, welcome to today's tutorial. Today's tutorial will be learning how to make bow tie. Well, it is very nice to learn how to make a bow tie. You can um, make a bow tie for your son or your boyfriend, whatever it is. So today, this is the measurement that we've been needing for our bow tie. As I have drafted it out, this is the bow tie. This is the bow tie part, uh, part. So what you need, you're going to cut it into two. The measurement for that, it is 27 centimeter long, and then the width will be 11 and a half centimeter. So that is for that. You cut it two, and then with the small bow straps, they will be eight centimeter width and then five centimeter long this is a very short one and you're going to cut it one because this is the one that you will put around your bow tie the third measurement that we need is 61 centimeter and six centimeter so you cut it like this this one we you cut one so this is the bow tie straps okay so that is for that so now the next thing we're going to do also is the handkerchief so the handkerchief that we need you know the guys like to put, uh, wear handkerchief that goes with their tie so this is the measurement of the handkerchief it's 23 centimeter width and 23 centimeter uh, the length so you're just going to draw it just like this square and that is for that so now i have done mine for the handkerchief this is what i did so this is the measurement and so after cutting it out i'm just going to uh, fold it i fold it this way i'm going to sew here sew here then i will fold this part and this part and then the handkerchief is done okay so now the next thing we're going to do is um the bow tie the bow tie i cut out a uh, fusible I use white fusible. You can use a thicker one if you want. If the if, you, if your fabric is light, perhaps it's better for you to use a thicker fusible. But in this case, my material is you know the fabric is quite thick, and this fabric it is um um African fabric, so it is really very thick. It is hundred percent cotton. So I have cut two and I infuse it as well so this is the um, the bow strips so I'm going to sew it here and this as well so let me just make sure it for you guys to see if it's actually correct okay that is it but I add a um, few centimeters because it's supposed to be one cent uh, 61 centimeter, but I add like uh, two centimeter just to enable me to sew it. But it's going to be um, adjustable, adjustable bow tie. You know, sometimes you make a bow tie for someone, it's uh, maybe it's a bit too small or it's too big. Sometimes you put elastic on it, but the elastic you put on it can be it, sometimes it's not comfortable. So it's better for you to have adjustable strips so that they can actually adjust it themselves okay so now what we're going to do the the bow tie we actually want to have like um five centimeter or six centimeter because this because the bow tie is going to be double bow tie so what i'm going to do now is to like you measure I want it to be six, so you measure like two and a half, two and a half, okay, two and a half. Yeah, this is two and a half. So, what you do is that measure this two and a half, measure this two and a half, and then you iron it, and then you do the same thing in both sides because we want to have this bow tie about hmm, depends on what you want anyway in this case i would like to have like 
eight centimeter eight centimeter I want it to be so I just have to fold with two and a half two and a half and then I'll iron it okay so I'm going to my ironing board now and iron it both sides the folding then I will show it to you the next step so this is what I did as I told you earlier I'm going to iron it and I did I iron I iron in two and a half centimeter which okay that is two and a half centimeter yeah so I iron it in both sides then what I did was I fold it into two equal parts because I want to have the center part of it so I fold it like this, I iron it, and then I open it, then I have this line here, that is the middle, and then I fold it like this, iron it, then I fold it again. So you iron very well. You have to press it good so that everything becomes the same. So I did it, the same thing in this, uh, in the second one. What happened is that I'm going to, this is what we're going to do, I'm going to sew here. So here and also here and here. What happened is that both of them are the same. That is what you need to to have. Both of them should be the same because it's going to be a double bow tie. So I will go and sew here now and here, and I will sew here and here. But don't worry, you will not see these raw edges because after sewing it together, I'm going to place it like this. So there you have this. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to sew that now. I will sew the uh, both straps here. And then I'm going to sew the, the longer strips. So I will just fold it like this. I will fold it like this. I will sew it th this way. And I will sew it all the way to the end of it. Then after that, I'm going to turn it out. I will show you my um, fabric uh, fabric toner, toner that I normally use. So, and I will do that. And then I will sew as for the handkerchief. I will sew here and sew here. And then I will then fold these parts. And I will fold these parts. Okay. So, actually, one more thing I want to let you know with, the, uh, with this bow tie is that I thought I'm going to make like um, six centimeter, but I decided to make it like eight centimeter wide because yeah, it's not a, a little boy, so this will uh, this is big enough, it's wide enough. It's not too wide, but it's just the size that I think would be best for this client. So. And then when I measure here, it is 12 and a half by eight, 12 and a half by eight inches. But this measurement that that we make here was like uh, 11 and a half centimeter. So, because you fold it and you fold it, but I decided to make it a little bit uh, bigger or longer and become eight centimeter and the and the length is 12 and a half centimeter so that is it now i'm going to my sewing machine and do all the sewing work and i will let you know um i will let you see the next project okay okay so now this is what i have done so far told you I'm going to make the, um, the handkerchief so I made that that's done and then this is what I did with the bow with the bow with the bow tie so as I told you I'm going to make double bow tie so I stitch both together and after that I stitch the raw side to the raw side together and then I stick the middle just like that and then you have like this okay so I sewed this 
and if you want to sew it, make sure that it is a little bit wider than the stitch that the stitch that you did. Otherwise, when you uh, put it around the bow tie, it might not fit, or they will see the stitching part. So that is why this strips has to be bigger bigger than the stitches that you make. And so I went ahead and sewed this as well, the longer strips. So what you do is that actually when you finish sewing them then you just turn it um, turn it in and out as you used to maybe with pen or pencil or other uh, tools that you use actually to uh, turn your fabric in and out. And so I did them and then I ironed it out. So, so what I did was I press it here, give a very good press. And this is actually the starting point when you want to uh, do this, uh, the bow tie strips. So what I actually did was I put it like this. But this is slider. This is slider. So like this actually yes so and then you put it in the second one here so I hope you guys can see what I'm doing okay so this is actually what we wanted then it's like this and then all what you need to do because you can see you can adjust so what I'm going to do next is to because I already fold here this starting point and I'm just going to sew it I will sew it like this I will sew it here okay so when that one is done the next thing I'm going to do I'm going to attach this very hook on it um when you are attaching it this hook has to be out it has to be um out okay just see what I'm doing right now I'm just like sliding in so like this because later it's going to be like this. So what I'm going to do, after stitching this together, then I'm going to show you the next step. However, this is what I'm going to do with this as well. I'm going to um, just make the, fold it like this, because I'm going to hold it like this, fold it like this. So I'm going to use my needle to sew it in the middle here. I will sew it round. And then I don't want to use needle to sew it so that it can be fasting. Then after that, I will show you the next step to do with this. So let me go to my sewing machine and sew this. I use needle okay. to sew this. So now this is what I did. I I sew it together and I just wrap the thread around it. And this is to enable you to secure the bow tie. You can see it is very secure. So the next thing I did was uh, just this and uh, I put it, I sew here that's what I did I sew here so you can see it is ready so we're going to the next thing we're going to do is we're going to slide this in because as I told you earlier we want this part to be up so we put it like this that is what you do you do it like this and then you take this and we're going to I'm going to put it in the slider like this and then the second like this okay so now you can see this I just you can see this has already this come here it's exactly what we want for this to be outside and then you can slide it like this you see so you can so this is done this is how it is so the next thing we're going to do is to put this within. So then, because it's going to be like this. So, so we just, um, so we put this like this. You can see. And then I'm going to sew here. I'm going to, I'll go to my sewing machine and sew it here. But by the time it's finished, then it's like, you can see then it's like this you see but that's how it's going to be so I will do that but before then what I'm going to let me explain something to you okay so I'm going to sew here okay and then the 
then this one the, um when i finish sewing this then i'm going to attach it to this one so what i'm going to do is we're going to measure if this here to here so we're going to look for the midpoint that is the middle of it so the middle of these strips here from here to here is like this then we're going to attach it to a bow tie like this okay so by the time we do that after we finish with that then we wrap this over it like this and we will then use the needle to sew that okay so i hope you understand what i'm trying to explain to you so now what i'm going to do first is to sew this so i'm going to sew that now and i will show you the finished products of the bow tie This is what I did. So I adjusted. I sew. I sew the. I sew this on it. So we are we we sew this um, here. So you can see you can slide in and out. So so okay. So this one just stays there like this. So the next thing I'm going to do now is to attach these strips. To a bow tie so this side is going to be so what I did was that I what you're going to do you between here and here you look for the midpoint so what I did was that look for the midpoint because just take that there okay so I look for the midpoint the middle then that is it so this is the middle of it so this middle I'm going to attach it to the bow tie. Remember, you attach it to the back of the bow tie. You can use a needle because um, right now, using sewing machine, not a good idea. So, okay. So, I use uh, this is the middle of my bow tie. So. And you'll do it like this just to secure it here okay okay so this is how you do it so you can see so when you do like this, then this is the front part. So you can see it's taking shape already. So just just so it the way you like it, just like this. So by the time you're done, nobody will see these stitches that you are using um, your needle to make. It's just to attach the strips on the bow tie okay all right all right okay just doing this to show you how we will do it So you make sure you use um, matching thread though, because that is that be very nice. Mm -hmm. So you make sure you you do this the middle of the bow tie, right? But this is very simple. This project just. Uh, uh, an evening project but if you don't have the time you can just do it maybe in a day you know but if you have the time to just do it it is 
evening project okay so it's already done so that is it you can see it is attached to it so what is what you do what you do so so see so you can do like this any size you want you can do like this so it's up to you so but i think also what i'm going to do i might just sew a little bit here to make it more uh secure not to move around you know because yeah this has no need to do anyway just this is important thing so i might consider doing that you can do that yourself or you don't you leave it like that but it's up to you but this is how you I, I, actually you face this so but the next thing i'm going to do now is to face the, the band it's actually the bow type band you know so these zero edges but what i do i'll just fold it a little bit in uh, nobody's anyway. so you just turn it like this so we're going to cover this thread that we did you can see what i'm doing so we're going to cover it up like this and like this so you can see the raw edges is covered the 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 thread is covered so then we just have to then we sew this inside so this is what we do so you can just do a little bit like that so as you can see and you have to use a very sharp needle if you don't do that it will be very difficult for you to sew because material is thick you know so So you do it very well secure what I'm doing now. Right. Okay. Oh, ow, ow. <laughs> All right. So you don't do it inside. Make sure you do it in the middle, in the middle of the bow tie. Because when you wear it, nobody will see that anyway. So when you do that backstage, you know. But the seat, you just do it inside and add. So this one actually serves as as band because now you you sew it, you hold everything together, and then everything is secure, you know. So like right this. So please try to make a bow tie for your sons, for your boyfriend, for your father, for your husband, so on and so forth. Yeah. Okay, so that is that. So I am done, so I will just cut this off later. So now let me show you the finished product, you see. So this is the finished product, so it's like this. So you can see, it's like this, you can adjust it, you can wear it like this, it's like this, so yeah, so you see, so you adjust it like this and here you go. So this is the finished product, you have the handkerchief that fit with it, so please try to uh, practice it because practice makes perfect. Thank you very much for watching and I wish you all a very good day. Okay, bye.